Hello students. Today's lesson aims to show how to measure quantities of solid and liquid substances using laboratory apparatus. We will prepare a potassium permanganate solution to show how to measure the substances and how to use the apparatus. It is very important to take accurate measurements of various quantities for better experimental results of scientific processes. For this experiment, we require the following chemicals. Potassium permanganate, a solid chemical compound which will dissolve in water to form a solution. And water, a liquid chemical compound which will be used to dissolve potassium permanganate to form a solution. We will be using the following apparatus. A chemical balance for measuring the mass of the solid. A watch glass to hold the solid while measuring the mass on the chemical balance. A beaker and glass rod for mixing the solid and liquid. And a volumetric flask for measuring the volume of the solution. Happy learning. Solid, we transfer it into the beaker containing an estimated volume of water. So we make sure that we rinse the we rinse the the weighing watch glass until this old solid sample is introduced into the beaker. After that one, we stir up the solution in order to make sure that the solid sample is completely dissolved. We make sure that it dissolves until the solid sample is dissolved. After dissolving the solution, we rinse the glass rod by using a distilled water. After that one, we transfer the solution into a volumetric flask. After that one, we also we wash the beaker by using distilled water and the washing to add them into the volumetric flask. And we don't wash it once, we wash it twice or thrice until all the solution is removed and all the particles are removed from the beaker and entered into the volumetric flask. After that procedure, we should add distilled water into the volumetric flask in order to bring the level of the solution to the mark. So we add it slowly until the level of the solution is in the mark of the volumetric analysis. volumetric flask. 